Hey guys, this is Miss Sharbro, and this is my daughter Aubrey. Um, she's a sixth grade student at Lafette Middle School. She's really embarrassed right now. Um, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna let her do the penny cube like we did today, um, since it was so great. I'm gonna show her the same video that I showed you guys, and let's see if we can uh, if we can figure this out. Okay, so Aubrey, this is a cube and it's got pennies in it. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna figure out how many pennies it takes to fill up the whole thing. I've done this before. I've done this before, okay. Okay, okay so what kind of information do you need to know to figure this out? What? <laughs> in order to know how many pennies it's gonna take to fill up this whole cube, what information do you need to know? Well, I need to know for one, how many pennies is going up? And then I see how many times that goes for one side, and then I just multiply it by how many times it'll go down. So how can you figure that out? You just make one row of pennies. Okay, make a row of pennies. Like stacked. Wait, do I need to draw a box? Well, what about the box? The box is what we're filling the pennies up with, so... How many... How many go in the box? That's what I need to figure it out. How can you figure it out? What information is missing that you need? The box. What do you need to know about the box? How big it is. I can tell you how big it is. How big is it? Six inches long. Yeah. Six inches tall, six inches wide. Okay, so let's say it's a penny per inch. Yeah, no. Oh, wait. I have a little bit. Okay, what do you need to know first? Okay, what are the dimensions of the cube? Write them down. six inches high. There's not enough pennies to go six inches high. Them. One penny per inch. One penny per inch? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so then I'd go six across. Say that. That's six times six, six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four, thirty-two. Hold on. How, why was it? What are you talking about? Six pennies per inch. That's how tall it is. Like there's one penny per inch. Like that's how tall it is. How how tall is an inch? How many pennies is that tall? Half an inch. Is there a way to figure that out? Yeah, one penny per inch. I don't understand what you're talking about, one penny per inch. Okay, let's just... One penny is not an inch tall. I know, I'm just pretending. But you don't need to pretend. I need to know the actual... <laughs> but you said there's not enough pennies to go six inch. Oh. Oh, okay, okay. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Eighteen pennies. Okay, now what are you gonna do with that? I spell pennies. Oh Lord. <laughs> mm. 
hold one inch. So if it's six inches high, mm -hmm. then that's 18 times six. Ninety-two. What? What? Six times eight? Eight, six, twelve. <laughs> six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four, thirty-two, thirty-six. No. No. Six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four, forty-eight. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> It's been a long day. Eight, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that's 108 inches tall. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's 108 inches tall? Yeah. I thought it was six inches tall. 108 pennies up is the height. Okay. Okay. And so then that's going to be, that's multiplied by six. So that's how high. Why are you multiplying it by six? Because that's okay. It's eighteen pennies per inch. Uh huh. So that's eighteen times six to see how much it'd go up. Uh huh. Then that'd go across. So then let's see. Then you do ha you have to do one hundred and eight times six. Why? Because if it's six inches, the length. Or the width is six inches, then. Does six pennies equal six inches? Yeah, because it's six across. Is it six across? It's six inches across. How many pennies across is it? Let's change the whole situation, Mom. Eight inches across. Mhm. Mm so it's eight inches across. I thought it was six inches across. It's eight pennies across. Okay. So eight pennies equals across. Okay. So eight pennies across. So that's eight times one hundred and eight. Mhm. Mm Eight hundred sixty four. So then eight hundred sixty four. Six times six. No, eight hundred sixty four times one hundred eight. What? Think about what it looks like. Okay. Well, what does eight hundred sixty four look like? What's 864 pennies look like? How'd you get 864 pennies in that cube? Cause, um, How much of the cube does it fill? One row. Mm -hmm. and then so how many columns are there? Six. Six, is there? What's the shape of the cube? Six inches. By? Six inches. So how many pennies by how many pennies? Six by six. Inches. How many pennies by how many pennies? Oh, eight by eight. So what's eight by eight? It'd be 864 times eight. Yeah. Eight. Six thousand nine hundred 
Final answer? 6,912 pennies in the cube.